Thank you for taking the time to look at this video. We're gonna go over a basic uppercut. Go ahead and put your hands up to that same position, making sure our hands and elbows are in, okay? Common problems with this punch, a lot of students will throw their arm back Popeye style and drive it in. Again, you can have shoulder issues. So what we wanna do here, as we start the punch, we're gonna bend our knees, get a little bit lower. In the case of the bag class, we're not obviously hitting upward, but we're gonna be hitting into the bag. So as you drop your knees, you're gonna go ahead and turn your hips. And again, we wanna make sure we're hitting with those two front knuckles. So go ahead and turn those hips and then drive it in. Hitting with the two front knuckles, wrist straight, elbow straight. This is a short punch. It doesn't need to be a long punch. In other words, you don't wanna drive it back. So just turn the hip in and hit with the two front knuckles. Go ahead and do a couple jab. There you go. Always return with your hands up. Even if we have a fast paced class, try your best to keep your hands up and elbows in. A couple different ways that we'll do it in class. She'll square up. So go ahead and square up, Jeanette. Same thing. And if we're going down low, we're going to hit the, into the gut. Bend your knees, turn your hips. Go ahead, Jeanette. So since it relates to fitness in a lot of ways with our classes, in this particular instance, you'll have your hands maybe consistently down in one spot. Just make sure you're using your hips and shoulders. And again, hitting with the two front knuckles. Okay, go ahead and do a few more. Again, side step version, stepping to the side as you do it. Try to keep it in tight as possible. Use those hips and shoulders to ensure, making sure that you guys uh, have safety in mind as you're hitting the back.